In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly set up Divi and add your API key. Now, as I mentioned in the initial video, this API key is very, very important for us. So over here, when you first install WordPress, this is what it's going to look like, but uh, it gives us very little flexibility. This is why we need Divi. So over here, let's download and install Divi. So I'm going to go into my account here, click on login, and I'm going to download Divi. Okay, great. So you can see here it's been downloaded on the bottom left of my, of my screen. Next, I want to come over here now to my site. Now, this is what you get when you use any of these hosting companies that I mentioned in the previous video. So let's log into our website by adding wp-admin. And here now you need to add your username and password. Okay, great. So now I'm in my WordPress admin dashboard. The next thing I need to do now is to install Divi by coming over here to appearance, click on themes, add new, now you can see here that we've downloaded it here at the bottom. So what we need to do now is to click upload. Now there's two ways to do this. You can click here on choose file and this will navigate and open up your folders so you can find the file, which in this case is the DV download. But in my case, I'm just gonna drag and drop it here. There we go. I'm gonna click now on install now. Excellent. So now it has been uh, uploaded. Next, I just need to activate it and we are all set. And to confirm that Divi has been installed, just take a look all the way down here where it says Divi. You should see a D all the way right at the bottom here. So that means Divi has been installed. Brilliant. So this is where now, before you even start thinking of designing your website, you need to add your API key for the reasons that I mentioned in the previous video. All right, so let's go ahead and add our API key. To add our API key, we wanna go back to over here to our dashboard on elegantthemes.com. We wanna scroll we going to come over here to account. We're going to scroll down here. You're going to see API keys. Click here on API keys, scroll all the way down. And here is our API key. So I'm going to click here to copy. And that's all I need to do. Back over here on my site now, I can come all the way down here to DV and then click on theme options. Next, we're going to come over here to updates. I'm going to enter my username and paste my password. Great. Now I can hit save changes and pretty much we are good to go.